Hello everybody. So today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equation. So now I will show you how to answer. So we have ask why ask they are the read number one. And this is about homogeneous. So the first thing we need to do, we need to divide both sides by the S. Next, I will put about Y equals to Vs. Later that, we need to do first the derivative for the both sides. So we do first the derivative of V we have dv over the s multiplied by s. Later that, we do first the derivative of s. We have number one, and then we have v. And this is about the product group of the derivative. So I will put v s gone here. This one we need to change by this one. Next, we divide both sides by S. Next, I will put number 1 go to the right. And later that, we divide both sides by V minus number 2. Next, I will put V go to the right. Next, negative, negative, we put on the left. Next, we need to do common denominator. So this one, we have v square minus 2v. Now, Number one combined to this one, and we have v square minus two v plus one, and we know that this is about identities. So I will put this one go to the left, the s and s go to the right. Next, I will put the integration for the both sides. Next, we need to concentrate on this integration. So I will use about integration by substitution. So I will put about u equal to v minus 1. And later that, we need to do first the derivative for the both sides. And we have the u equals to dv. So negative number 2, we can put into negative number 1 and negative number 1. So v minus 1, we change by u. Similar for this one dv we change by the u so u divided by u square we have 1 over u the next one is about 1 over u square this one we have ln of the absolute value of u and the second one that's about 1 over u and i will put about c about u that is above v minus 1. Now we go back in here. The integration of this one that is about this one. 
and the integration of this one that is about ln of the absolute value of x and I will put about c about v that is about this one so we need to divide both sides by s and now we need to change v into y over s next number one we can change by s over s so this one we can put into y minus s over s so we have the formula in here ln a minus ln b equals to ln of a over b so this one we can change by this one Now we have negative side, we change the side of this one. Now we simplify ln of the absolute vo value of s for the both sides. Next, we multiply S for the both sides. Oh, sorry, multiply this S in here. So we have like this. Next, we multiply Y minus S for the both sides. Next, we put negative for the both sides. Next, C contain positive or negative. So, in this situation, we can change negative side in here. And here is the final answer. Now, Let's consider to the second way. So we need to divide both sides by dy. Now we put about s equal to vy. Later that we do first the derivative for the both sides. First the derivative of v we have dv over dy multiplied by y this one we have number one so we have v so we put vy going here the s over dy we change by this one So S we change by Vy. Now we simplify Y for the both sides. So I will put this one go to the right and we divide both sides by V. Next, we need to open parentheses and I will put V go to the right and we have negative V. This one we do common denominator. So we combine two fractions in here.
this one that say about identity so this one i will put on the left the y and y will put on the right Next, we put the integration for the both sides. So I will put negative number one in here. Later, that we need to add back positive number one. So v minus one divided by v minus one. So we have 1 over v minus 1 and the second one 1 over v minus 1 square. So this one we have ln of the absolute value of v minus 1 and the second one that is about negative number 1 over v minus 1. This one we have ln of the absolute value of y and I will put about C about V that is about this one so we divide both sides by Y and now we need to change V into this one so this number one I can put y over y so this one I can put s minus y over y so we can put ln of the absolute value of s minus y minus ln of the absolute value of y now we simplify negative ln of the absolute value of y for the both sides. We multiply by y on numerator and denominator. So this one we have s minus y. Later like that, we multiply by s minus y for the both sides. So we see that this one and this one, they have the same values. So both persons in here, they are correct. This is the end. Thank you for watching.